in the NBA during the regular season in the first quarter. They double team him. Crowder at the free throw line. Aiton inside, jump hook with the putback. So good with that jump hook. So good. wasn't ready for the pass. He went right through his hands. Brunson at the other end. Over Jalen Brunson taking advantage. Here's Aiton out top. Booker on the handoff. Good show by Powell. Booker one on one against Bullock. Gets into the lane and lays it in with a teardrop. You saw some of the shots he made in that game five. He can go right, he can go left. Loves to finish off that right foot, too. Bullock on the baseline. Missed the tip. Three for a quarter. Got the third one. The field in the last three contests. Pocket pass by Booker. One more inside. Aiden with a sweet finish. Great pass there is that the Suns have capable wing defenders. Mikel Bridges, Jay Crowder, Cam Johnson at times. Brunson switches a 15-footer. It's a welcome sign. His slot. Jay Crowder with the catch and go to an empty paint as a defender on that closeout. Because mm -hmm. you have to run him off. The veteran that anchors a lot of their defense. And has been to the NBA Finals in consecutive years. Road team in the NBA as Maxi Kleba inside. Watch that one go through the bucket. We talked to the open about guys joining the party. And Maxi's had some great moments in this series. Dorian Finney-Smith, of course, in game four. They've got to have multiple guys have big nights for them to extend the series as Jay Crowder. Booker on Finney Smith, Bullock missed everything. That's going to be out of bounds off of Luca. Nope, it's going to be off of Phoenix and Chris Paul. We were talking about it a little bit earlier as we watched this ball go out of bounds off of Chris Paul. It's been three games now as Finney Smith knocks down the three. It's been three games since Chris Paul has really looked like the Chris Paul that we're used to seeing. And some of that is just the circumstances. Chris has a certain cadence and pace to his game. Right. He works himself into the action, gets his teammates involved, and looks to take over in the fourth quarter. They didn't need him as Booker again wow. getting to that left hand for the pull-up, too. They didn't need him. Mavs looking to keep the talk up and avoid being done tonight as tensions, like Lucas said, are normal, especially. In the playoffs without a little bit of contentiousness and malevolence. Well, first two seasons, yeah. the Clippers, when you're looking at wing defenders like Kawhi Leonard and Paul George, even though he's put up performances, uh, he's still come away with a couple of losses. See if he can change the trend here tonight. Well, I was on that team last year, obviously not playing in the playoffs. We had him up 3-2, game six here, and Kawhi Leonard just had one of the greatest individual yeah. games I've witnessed in person. Nice skip pass to Crowder for three. Jay Crowd at three, shooting over 50%. Got a look at this year's NBA Coach of the Year, Monty Williams, on the sidelines. Kleba knocks one down. Kleba checked into the ball, and they've got numbers. Luca inside like a layup drill. Great sequence there from Luca. His deep. The Suns are using his man as a screener in pick and roll 25 times a game in this in this series. Wow. They're absolutely targeting him. Aiden, that's his shot over the left shoulder. That a little nice a little bit because the ball's going to be in CP's hands more. And obviously he understands that because now he's on a championship level team. A little empty side two man game. Bullock goes to the screen. Luca with the step back. Got it. Bridges on Luca. He rejects the screen. Boy, that was light work for Luca. Doncic has scored the last seven for the Mavericks. Booker inside. A feathery float game. We've seen now three times. Four of nine so far. Booker three of four. What do you make of the shot distribution for the Mavericks so far? We'll start with them, JJ. Well, I, I just like the aggression from Luca. Coming out, getting into the paint, putting that pressure on the rim. That's ultimately what's going to open up three-point opportunities for his teammates. Lobs for Dwight Powell. 
because the Suns have made an adjustment. They're right. not sh they're showing help, but they're further out on the perimeter. They're not hugged up, but they're further out. And so his ability to just get in the paint and put pressure on the rim is really important. Meanwhile, Devin Booker doing his share of the heavy lifting offensively for Phoenix, leading the way with eight points. Chris Paul on the bench right now. Has not taken a shot, has not scored yet in the game. Here's Bridges. Powell switches on to him. Bismack Biombo gets the first call at the five spot off the bench. Not JaVale McGee, and he rewards Monty Williams with an early bucket, JJ. <laughs> what a great story, too. Guy wasn't on a roster to start the year. Signed a 10-day because of the Omicron outbreak. Now playing meaningful minutes in an elimination game in the second round. And this is the second straight game we've seen Landry Shamit getting the backup point guard minutes for the Phoenix Suns. Cameron Payne on the bench. One on the shot clock for Doncic. A 9-1-1 on the way. Drew Iron. And good defensive sequence that time for the Suns. Under two minutes to go here in the first and opening quarter. Suns trying to put away the Mavericks, trying to put them to sleep for the season. Up three games to two. Bridges on Powell. And now Bertan switches on to him. Tough shot. Rebounded by Luca. On the move. The kick out. Dinwiddie, one more wide open Bullock. And Shamit with.